Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, another episode of Blasted Oasis. So, got a few things done last night. I reinforced the front of the house, I made some meat stew, which we got a lot of now, which is excellent. Let's use another water here before we go. So we got enough food to last us for a while. Uh, I've got all this stuff loaded up. I don't think, I know Trader Day is technically the 28th, which is tomorrow. Um, but uh, I'm taking everything with me today because I think we missed the trader, the South Trader. So we're going to go check him today and sell some stuff. So I updated the walls inside here, updated all this to reinforce concrete, did a little bit of this here. Uh, got some of these reinforced. We'll have to do the rest later uh, when we come back. Didn't do anything else outside, but uh, I was going to go in the mine and do some mining, but I just didn't feel like it. So let's get rolling. The bike's down outside. I laid down four more... Uh, uh, plots out here plus I reinforced the roof a little bit out here. We had some damage I think from vultures last time so um, I did some reinforcement up here so the vultures can't get to us because we are going to use this section here as the horde base um, For the next time because we don't we've only got today and tomorrow to to get stuff done And this is that's just not enough time to get what I'm planning um, on for day uh, 35 to be done so we're not, we're not just going to have to not worry about that. Alright, so let's jump on the bike and head down to the other trader. Okay, we're here a little bit early, so I'm going to go and hit up some wood. We used a bunch of wood last night. So I want to get some wood, I want to get some iron. Have a look around here, see if there's anything else that we can dig up. What's up? Buddy. Oh, exchange of blows. Alright, Joel's open. So let's drop off some of this stuff in the bike. <sighs> Not a lot, but we can leave that in there for now. Let's leave this in there for now, too. Gotta get used to leaving those in there. I know I always carry them around with me, it's just habit. Uh, hackers. Yeah, nothing I really wanted in there right now. Let's go see what this guy's got. Oh, 44 out, please. Thank you. Hello, What's up, buddy? Stranger. Got anything good for me today? We got gunpowder. Cripple them schematic. Bellows. I can't remember if we got enough bellows back home. I think we do. Bellows just lets you get lets your stuff get in the forge faster. It's like 50% faster or something, or 33% faster. 50%, yeah. Um, compound crossbow. Battery bank, generator bank, we don't need. Uh, structural brace. Nothing there we want. Blueberries. We make blueberry pie with these guys. Um, we just planted a blueberry last night, so not really a lot, is there? So I don't want to waste, we're going to take this, we'll take this, no oil shell, huh? Okay, um, going to take your cement, I'm not going to use, I'm not going to bother using the, uh, sugar butts and stuff, it's not worth it. Just be a waste of money. I'm going to buy these. Bullet tips. Got a level, a th level 3 AK at home, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, I think that's it. I don't think... I mean, the cripple them schematic would be nice, but I think I want to hold on to my cash right now. And I don't necessarily absolutely have to have a bellows, so... Do I want to just sell all this stuff? Or do we wait till tomorrow? Nah, because if I... Thanks for shopping let's here. go ahead Come and here. use this guy. We'll sell all this stuff. Because chances are we're going to be coming back with stuff today anyway, so... Alright, let's get rid of you. Oh shoot, I was Thanks supposed to repair here. some Come of these guys. Let's repair you. Is that going to be worth it? I don't know. That'll be more worth it, I think. Alright, let's just sell this stuff. Um, wait a minute. Do Thanks we have... Shopping here. Come again. Oh yeah, we got the right gloves on. Just wanted to make sure. Alright, well we made some good coin. We started off with 17,000. 
So we made about 6,000 coin off that, so that's all right. I'm gonna save this. This is just for buying anyway, um, plus 5%. So there's no point, like, we're not really buying that much, so there's no point in using it. So, all right, let's just go with that. Safe and travels. let's, yeah, man. Oh, wait, do you have a job out west at all? How many jobs out west? Lots of jobs. Fetch clear. I have a task for you. Ranch friend. house. Okay, maybe next time. Um, Safe travels, friend. 1.4 ranch house. Okay, I'll find somebody else. Um, s two more fletch fetch fletches. Fetches. Victorian house, eh? Hey? All right, let's do a fetch clear. Mind. Let's take the closer one. A little predicament. Ranch house. Godspeed. Where is that? Oh, it's over this town. All right, so we got to drive through here and up this way. So what I want to do is, um, what does it take to make a flaming barrel? Burning barrel, forged iron and wood. We got the wood. You got six forged iron I can get. Because I think we, we should do. You don't have any forged iron, that figures. Damn it. Well, Are if we find some it? on the way. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and use this. I normally don't use these, but let's read it. We got a chance to do it while we're out somewhere. Where is it, anyway? Disorderly orderlies. Where are you? Um. Am I blind? That's clear. It can't be that far away. Uh, okay. Well, if we come across it, we come across it. If we don't, we don't. Why do I think it's back? I don't know where it is. Forget it. All right, so we're going to go off and do this quest. I was hoping to put some burning barrels where we need to turn. Sure we're loaded, yep. All right. I'd like to say I'm loaded for bear, but really I'm loaded for vulture. So what I wanted to do with those burning barrels is I want to put them at the corners I need to turn at so I can easily find my way to where the road into this town is and the road out of this town. Oh, lining this guy up. Lining him up. Oh, yeah, it can come with me for a while, buddy. And that way, when I ride into the town, I, c I know where I'm going. Like, where I need to turn. So I don't have to stop. Okay, now it's north from here, I think. Is there a road around the back? I don't think there is. Of course not. Oh, there's a bear back here, though. There's the road out of town. All right. Let's get back on it. Head this way. Are we even on the right road? I don't think we are. No, we are. Okay. That's weird. It just doesn't seem like the right road. Oh, yeah, that's right, because we have to go by those farmhouses. That's right. Excuse me. All right, now here's the fork. Perfect. All right, I'm kind of getting it now. It's so much easier in a green biome for some reason, but this everything here just looks the same. It's like everything is the same. But well, we only had one vulture on our ass today, which is good. Okay, I'm going to turn the bike around. Point it on the direction to get the fuck out of here. Go deal with this job. Fetch clear. Thought I saw something moving there for a second. All right. I can expect anything. Most likely dogs. Let's just turn this light off until we need it. Now there should be. I think there's someone right behind here. If I remember correctly. Nope. 
Now I can't hit him under that door. Unfortunately, I can't sneak over the trench. Okay. There's two of them. Well, that didn't work out. Thought if I was down under here, they couldn't hit me. Okay, I can see your foot, and I think I can get a piece of that. Ooh, I can see your head. Hey, Mo. I do like these clear quests because it's like you can easily see where all the enemy are and it just shows you. I know they do that for a reason. It's just so that you know you've gotten everybody so that while you're doing the clear you're not forgetting anything. Let's see if there's anything behind here. Anything under there? Nothing. So we're going to grab all the stuff up here first. Then we're going to make our way downstairs. Because I don't think we're coming back up here. Alright, now we can leave you and you. We've got tons of paper back home, so we don't need to keep that now. Alright, a little bit of concrete. A little bit of concrete. Not much else up here. Nothing else? Oh, what's this? Something's behind there. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, story of my life. Free hugs. Come on, drop down for some free hugs. Not today. Still don't trust it. Aha, uh -huh, yeah. See? <laughs> now what? Spider monkey in the closet? Cop in this closet. Fuck me. Ooh, the spider guy didn't hear me. We had so much problems with these guys last time. Well, two episodes ago. Yeah, motherfucker. Not today. Alright, let's see if there's anybody in here. Can't see anybody. Oh man, we got so many water bottles at home, we don't need any more. Got like 125 of them or something. Nothing up there. I should check behind here. Try and find one of those, the safe or something. Now what we're going to do is going to take this apart. For the springs. I brought some pipe bombs. We certainly could have used a few pipe bombs in the episode I got murdered. Uh huh. And she's a runner. And you ran right into it, didn't you, lady? Alright, what have we got in here? Uh, we'll take both of these guys. I'm just gonna go ahead and scrap the pipes. Don't need that. Gotta be, like I said before, I gotta be more discerning with what I keep and what I don't. 
Early game, I like to keep everything, but I gotta get used to later game letting a lot go. Just keep what I need. Got so much cloth at home. Painting. Painting. Nothing. Okay, before we go in this closet, close that door up. We've gotten here. Yeah, I think without the M60 here, I think we'll be uh, a lot less loud. Uh huh. Who is he fighting? Is he fighting a zombie? Okay, this is the kind of the ground floor. Let's make a frame. Something that we can quickly uh, remove, but this can be an escape point for us if we need it. Actually, let's keep that. Ah, uh, you know what it is? They sometimes get caught on stuff. And they take damage, they get caught like in a block. So it sounds like the bear is like caught in a block. Crap, this is a bad, uh, this is a bad time. Two open rooms, of course it is. Okay, we got a guy in here. Let's deal with this guy first. Can we get him from here though? I don't think so. Still alive. He's a runner. That's what you get. That's what you get. Okay. Nothing else is showing up on my radar. But that don't mean shit. That just means I'm about to die. Let's go ahead and use that. And go ahead and scrap these. We can drop you, drop you, scrap this. Sorry if it's dark, guys, but I gotta keep this light off. Okay, we got somebody in there. It looks like it's just one. We're gonna go around this way and see if we can get them. Turn it on in here, though. That goes downstairs. Shit, that's bad. Duct tape. Do we need... Is that just a sprain or is that a... That's a sprain, right? I can't do anything about that. Oh, okay. Let's use one of these guys. Not the best thing to use, but that's the one we're going to use. Thought I heard a dog panting there for a second. We're gonna hold on to that. In case we need to heal up a little more. Come on, give me some water in here. Beautiful. Give me one more. Nope. Well, you gave me one. I should be happy, I guess. I don't think there's anything in these guys, no. What do we got in here? Brown dye and scrap. There's a fucking dog outside.
Hear him? Fucking dogs outside. Wonder if I should go up and let him in. Actually, let's go back around this way. Make sure this back room over here is cleared. Look at all the trash here. I don't know if he hears me down here. I think that's just his typical angry, uh, I'm an angry dog sound. Take that. Sure. Nothing. Anything behind there? Just boxes. Let's grab this stuff. Okay, let's drop some crap. <sighs> kind of hoping I can find some military stealth boots. Definitely going to need them for later, I think. I mean, they're not really as stealthy as people think they are. Just because it says military stealth boots doesn't mean they're really stealthy. It just means that they don't... Like, military armor adds sound. It just means they don't add any sound. That's all it means. Okay, let's not break anything on the walls. Is this locked? Nope. This is why we keep the pipe bombs on us. Where's this last guy? There you are. Hey, Mo. I think this is the main loot, too. Oh, yeah. But we're not cleared here. We got to clear... I think there's still some stuff up on the next floor. There's that girl that we never killed in the... Uh... Oh, there's a fucking bear out there now, too. I think there's a girl up on the, um, in the uh, cupboard up there that we never got. This is actually a good stash of loot. I wish I brought loot and candy. All right, well, let's go ahead and use you. And use you. And scrap. We're going to be ditching stuff for sure, but I'm just going to grab whatever we can grab here. Nope. Probably just scrap those. Ooh, level two battle axe. Double barrel shotgun. That's worth 50. Anything in there? Three duct tape. Well, I'd like to make a splint, but it won't, it won't give us any effect. All right, let's go ahead and scrap these guys. That's worth 98 though. Actually, you know what? Let's repair. We got repair kits, right? Two. How many did we get? A lot. Repair that. Repair this. Repair this. Sure. Let's pick this lock. That bear's not going to go away anytime soon either. Alright, so we got to pick up the White River supplies, which are upstairs. Yeah, it looks like there's just one left up. We got that white dot with the arrow above it at the top bar there. This means that there's one area with uh, zombies left in it. It's not like the bears. No, he's still out there. He'll hear us in a second anyway. Okay, that's just one zombie. 
It's all the major loot. Let's go ahead and scrap these guys. Um, repair that. Let's go ahead. Do we have a... Uh, we do. Can I put... I can. You know what? I can put one of these guys. This is the tempered... Increases block damage by 10%. We'll take that in there. And then we can modify this guy and put this one in there. Actually, you know what? Take that out. Let's modify this one. Those two in there would be worth a lot more. Alright. We gotta sh... Why does it seem like the game is all of a sudden way harder than it used to be? I didn't do anything to the difficulty. I guess you reach a certain day and the game's just like, fuck you. Alright, let's not fuck around anymore. So we know we got a dog out there. We know we got a bear out there. I heard a spider zombie. And that's a wandering horde. So where is our bike? Right out that way. Where'd the zombie go that was there? Is she in the... F on this side? Where the fuck did she go? Oh, the clear areas is done. All of a sudden. Did she like despawn or something? That's really weird. Let me grab that. Not that I need it anymore. We got so many of those kits. Go ahead and use this. And scrap. Now, where are you? Oh, yeah, of course. I was like, don't break those, make too much noise. We're going out this fucking window right here. Fuck you, bear. Alright, let's go home. Okay, I just pulled over here beside the, uh... Let's drop a bunch of stuff in here. I pulled over here beside the, uh, the barn. Because I want to quickly go in here. I think we can quickly loot this place. Maybe I'm pushing my luck, I don't know. I probably am. But I think we can probably... Can I get all that in there? Not all of it, but most of it. I think we can quickly do this place. We don't have to kill everybody. Just enough to get the main loot. Anybody in there? There's a snack. Looks like that's it over there. Now there's probably one up there. There might be on some on the next level. Let's grab this guy. Did I drop something? No. There's another snake out there though. Looks like it's pretty close. Okay, so this floor is quiet. I think it's just the top. 
I'm only gonna I'm gonna sneak because I don't want dogs and stuff coming in here. It's got plenty of cobble and concrete or cement mix. Is that Mo? No, it's Kenny. And he's a runner. Dick shot. Yeah, not bad. I mean, that was pretty simple. Let's hope we get some half decent stuff out of this place. Ah, more metal tool parts. Ah, crap. A little bit more ammo. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be complaining about ammo. Blood bags. All right. A little bit of fuel. We can drop that right in the bike. Yeah, more ammo. That's nice. All right, I'm going to grab this uh, cement mix and get back on the bike. Yeah, I found another ammo pile over here. 18 shotgun rounds. Not bad. Make up for the stuff that we've been using for the past little while. Let's go down here. Nothing in the trash. There's a crawler outside. Let's grab this. What was that snake still there? Wouldn't mind getting that thing before we go. Now there's no tracks. Of course there's no tracks now. Ooh, gunpowder. There is a dog around, but I think he's fairly far away because you can just barely hear him. Well, I got one of my bandages back. Good thing about picking up all this concrete is I don't have to like, or cement, sorry, is spending my time melting down stone to, to make uh, cement mix. It's already done for me. Ooh, another battle axe. Wire tools. Take this apart. It's a little bit left out here. And you know what? There's a pig outside too. I think we should probably go and kill. This Hey, buddy. And there's also a couple people usually out there. Let's go kill this pig. Man, like I said, I'm so used to insane where you go after a pig like that and he just murders you. Then again, I got a good bow, so I shouldn't really, uh, shouldn't really be talking. It's pretty easy when you got a good bow and you got good stealth damage. All right, let's get to that trader. I'm not going to sell anything there. We're just going to go turn the quest in right after we run this bear over. Excuse me. Oh, good thing I'm on the bike. It was like the bike, the bike gave me extra armor or something. Holy crap. That was pretty good. Thought for sure we were going to be in trouble there. Okay, waterworks. That's what I gotta remember. Waterworks and Shamway, that's where the thing is. And there's another cracker book here. Alright, I'll have to come back. Uh, maybe not tomorrow. Because you know how I am. I come back here tomorrow and I'll be like, there's another cracker book here too. Ah, uh, where's the electronic store? If I come back here tomorrow, I'll end up getting like, well, whoop. excuse me, couldn't pass that up. You know what? I will come back here tomorrow. Screw it. We'll come back. There's the electronic stop shop. We'll come back here tomorrow. I think it's down one more, right? Or is this the right road? No, it's one down from the electronic store, right? Isn't it? Yeah. One road down from the electronic store. Oh my god, that bear hit me straight on. Barely did- oh, he didn't do any damage to me either. 
Oh, that's a snake. Where are you, buddy? There you are. Oh, for crying out loud. We're running low on meat. That's why I want to make sure we... I mean, we're down to 75. That's not really low, but... It's low for me. I like to try and keep my meat my meat stock above 100. There's another snake here. Where, though? You know what? Let's not push our luck. Alright, I think what we gotta do tomorrow... Rather than going to the crack of books, I think we gotta spend the time working on the base. We gotta go... Ooh, that's nice. I wonder if we... I should be taking this. But I can't... I can't... I don't have the fuel to make Molotovs, though. We'll just take that. Oh! Okay, next level. Beautiful. We've got Night Stalker. Shotgun, duckbill, steroids are worth more. Um, but the duckbill we can put on something and sell and we'll get more for it. Uh, that's the regular jobs we looked at. <sighs> Alright. Forget it, we're out of here. We gotta, we gotta make sure we have the uh, front of our base ready for the horde tomorrow. Come here, lady. Wow. So when we get back tonight, when we get back, I'm gonna unload everything, take it all upstairs, then we're gonna come down with the hammer and uh, work on getting that, at least that floor part hammered out. It's got to be reinforced concrete. And then we got to put another level of reinforced concrete on top of it. So as long as I can get it to concrete, regular concrete before the horde tomorrow, which I don't think should be too much of a problem. Even if it's just cobblestone, it'll be fine. But we got to reinforce the front of the base too to um, reinforce concrete for the horde tomorrow. Because it's if, any, if the last horde would like any indication what this next one's going to be like. It's going to be nasty. All right, let's get this stuff inside. All right, just kind of throwing everything in the, uh, the cell chest for now. Brought the stuff down so we can just get started on this. Let's keep the bike with us. All right, let's get working on this stuff. At least filling in what we've got here. We pick these guys up for now. I don't have any wood on me? Oh, for crying out loud. Let's go ahead and dig, at least dig this up. As long as this is reinforced concrete, this is where the wall is going to be. It's going to be hidden anyway. This edge part will be hidden. Because there'll be another block on top of it and then a block in f like on the outside in front of it. Just when you think you made enough frames. Alright, let's get this at least into wood. Alright, so that's the base, base part of it. Now let's go ahead and just knock the rest of this stuff in. I know I shouldn't be outside here, but just going to finish repairing the front here. There we go. So that's the, the main part of the horde base ready for horde night. Now tomorrow... We'll spend the day portion of the episode getting everything ready to go, I think, for Horde. So, I'm going to hammer as much of this in as I can. Uh, if I can get the regular concrete, that'll be great. I made a whole bunch of rebar frames. I made like 200 rebar frames, so hopefully the rest of this should go quickly. Um, and what I'll do is I'll be making concrete like every night. Um, and then, you know, hopefully we have enough to fill it all in as reinforced concrete before the horde. And then we'll have, the. there's going to be like little corner turrets on the, each corner over here that's going to house where the electrical fence post will be covered by concrete. 
so they can't get destroyed on Horde Knight. And then we'll have the three sides that we can throw pipe bombs out of. And uh, that should work, I think. I think we'll be just fine for day 35. But for this next Horde Knight, this will all be concrete floor. We'll, I'll probably pull out the steps. Well, maybe I'll leave the steps. I don't know. No, i got to pull them out anyway. I don't know if I'll do that tomorrow. But anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I didn't die, which is wonderful. I didn't even get close to dying this time. Well, took a bit of damage, but we did okay. All right, so I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.